I'm Jeff Rand. This is the Okavanga Delta. Um, I've been operating here in Botswana for over 25 years. This is my 31st season hunting professionally. Primarily dangerous game. That's what I do and that's what I've always done. We hunt uh, primarily elephant, Cape buffalo, lion and leopard. You know, I've hunted over 150 elephants with clients and decided I was going to start hunting an elephant for myself once a year. I've really gotten into it. I love elephant hunting. I like getting in close. I like the frontal brain shot. So we're going to do an elephant hunt myself and we're going to try and get it as close as possible. An elephant's defenses rarely depend upon escape and concealment, but on size and aggression. This means that encounters between hunter and elephant can often have unintended results. You get in close and you get in his space. His form of defense is, is attack. He makes you make a decision. He comes at you and he wants a reaction. And, you know, if it's something that it's not a trophy that you've just gone in to have a look at and you need to try and back out uh, because you've got a tag and a license. If you fill that by shooting that animal, that's your hunt. He didn't really know what we were. He just knew there was something there, so I wanted to know we were humans and uh, he backed off. These old bulls are not afraid of very much. Bull's got a good, a good right tusk on him. Try to look to the left. One in the front, he knows something's up. He keeps looking back. One nice bull, um, gonna leave him for now, but uh, keep him in the back of our mind, see what, uh, what else we see. We're seeing 10, 15, 20 bulls a day, and it, it'll pick up as many as 50 bulls a day is not unusual. So, let's see what we can see. For the female of the species is more deadly than the male, wrote Rudyard Kipling in far less politically correct times. But it is something that a Rand Safari's professional hunter and his client saw firsthand one day when a false charge became all too sincere. This charge ended with the need for some bodywork and fresh paint, instead of an airlift to a hospital. But if a cow elephant is prepared to throw herself against several thousand pounds of steel safari vehicle, then what chance would a flesh and blood human have against her? You're just a little speck on the ground, really, you know, compared to a seven-ton animal. And when he comes, he comes fast, and you better be prepared to stop him. After tracking many elephants for many miles across Botswana's Okavango Delta, professional hunter Jeff Rand finally sighted the bull he's been looking for. Now the delicate dance of working into position for a shot begins. The only real advantage Rand has is the elephant's rather poor eyesight. He and his trackers must thread their way through the wind currents to remain undetected by that sensitive trunk and move quietly enough not to alert those giant ears. As the big bull steps away from the others in its herd and out from behind the obscuring cover, Ran must move into range to get a sure, open-sighted shot on the elephant, if it agrees to cooperate. Probably should have taken him that second. 
might be a little bit closer. Let's make sure the shot is getting around, get on the wind and try again. I think I want to start feeding this way, coming this way. I'm gonna approach him. And uh, as soon as he goes down, I'm gonna run up on him and get close. It's the safest place to be, close to the down elephant in case the others come after you. Rain, rain him that last shot. With him coming at me like that, ended up shooting low a little bit on his brain on the first shot. Stunned him even on his big gun, it's 5.77, and uh, gave him a brain shot when he was standing there, but it's elephant hunting. You can't always make a perfect shot, but you gotta be able to be prepared to, to make a good second shot and just steep, keep with it, don't, don't lose concentration. Most of an elephant's enormous skull consists of a honeycomb of hollow bone surrounding a relatively small brain deep inside. A sudden toss of the head can mean missing the brain. So the worth of an instant second shot is again proven. It's a great hunt. Uh, you know, I, he was a great trophy and uh, was a great old bull. I, I really can't tell you how much I enjoy hunting elephant. It's, it's just a thrill and a passion and uh, something I'll do until the day I die. <laughs>